for the fact that you are a trader there are key things you need to have in mind you don't need to be trading all the time so you need to have that in mind and you need to remember that there are four trading sections we have in the market so we have the london session we have the new york section we also have the tokyo session and world and the asian session so bear this in mind so that whenever you are trading you should be able to know which section you are actually trading on so that you know which one to how to or which pair you can be able to focus on so in today's video i'm going to teach you how to trade new york open breakout strategy you understand what this means is that as soon as the time for new york uh, section to start you start looking out for this particular setup so i'm going to teach you the breakout strategy that you are going to be using during new york session it works both in london section so you can be able to use it both new york and london section all right so make sure you pay attention there is something i want you to bear in mind not all the pair because this is what this is new york session so there are key pairs that you need to focus on the first one is usd J uh, usd pair is what you need to focus on you have euro pair and gbp pair this for instance we have gbp usd we also have euro usd you, these are usd pair so if it comes to euro you have uh, euro usd so this is the pair you need to focus on during this section all right so having that in mind remember that new york section new york section starts by what by 8 a.m eastern standard time if you are in nigeria or west africa it's it's what 2 p.m you understand west african time 2 p.m or 1 p.m utc all right so just you can convert it to your own time so that you know the exact time so even if you are not trading every other time once it is this particular time you can be able make sure you master everything i'm going to be explaining to you in this video all right so that you can be able to deploy it in this once it's this particular time you don't need to be all day long you are looking at the chart and analyzing once it's this particular time you should be able to apply what i'm going to be teaching you so pay attention very well remember the the there, there is something you need to understand you need to what the the strategy you are going to be applying is chart pattern the break out of chart pattern if you do not understand what chart pattern is then pay attention all you need to do is just to go to your google all right when you go to google just type chart pattern you should be able to see something like this you need to cool down and understand this we have continuation pattern you see it for instance now you see here here we have continuation this is what this is attending ascending triangle we have bullish flag you understand we have a bullish wedge we have this one symmetric triangle you understand so you need to cool down and understand how these things works so you see this particular one head and shoulder we see you see head and shoulder we see this one rising wedge all this thing download it to your phone you need to, no need to memorize it you can just hold it to your phone once you are analyzing the chart or you are looking at the chart looking at where to enter you should be looking at this pattern the break out of it as you can see here in this one let's say for instance this rising wedge you see here you see this uh, a double top you see we have entry that entry means when price break out of this zone before you should be able to look to enter all right why your stop loss sl means stop loss so you could down and master this or you can print it and paste it on, on your wall so that you, you understand what you are doing you don't need to cram it you can just you know take a look at it when you are looking at the chart then let's take for instance now let's say any of these once you take a look at it and let's say you are looking for what for maybe in the market you see something like this particular one which is what which is bullish flag if i take you to the market so in the market like this so if you come here you see this is what this is example of bullish flag you understand so what do you do what what you are meant to do is to pay attention once it's that time that i just show you so you come and start sketching something like this you understand once it's that time so once you see this candle that break out that is when world when you will enter you understand that's the breakout strategy the reason why you are waiting for this time is because it will make you see all this spike because there is high liquidity in the market you understand that is why the reason why the market will move faster compared to when you are looking for this setup in ordinary time so this particular period is the best time for you to actually take a look at it this is just any of the pattern can form here as you can see here you see this particular one here 
you see this particular one we have here so the same thing the break out of here will determine your entry so that is what you need to be applying during what during new york session you make sure you make a time and once it's this time that is the time you want to start trading if you go and back test this thing you will see that it play out a lot you can do it remember you can do it in usd pairs euro pairs and the word gbp pair all right so for instance basically major clauses you understand that's the place you can be able to apply this and it will work very well but make sure you do well you do well to back test it why do you really need to wait for this time the one reason is that in because it's this uh because there is high liquidity you understand the new york session just open as you can see you don't need to waste time before markets will hit your take profit or stop loss you understand it's just uh, just like sometimes if you place a trade you keep waiting oh the market is constantly it's not moving anywhere during this particular period that i'm telling you the market tend to do what move very fast secondly why should you wait that time the second one it will filter first break because sometimes maybe if you just think if you are if you if you are doing it aside of this time you may think that the breakout want to maybe this candle here you may think it's a breakout the next day market will reverse so if it break out this during this period it tend to move fast compared to when you are looking for those setup when the market there is no much liquidity in the market so if you find value in this video just forget to click the subscribe button and also like the video